think the thing that shocked me most is that as a faculty member, it's easy to get connected to the classroom and stay in that space. As faculty, oftentimes our training is to be connected to our students, to the curriculum, to find out what's new and innovative and bring that information to our students. And I have to admit the classroom is my, is my first initial love, but as interning these last couple months, I've found a new love, I would say, and that would be administration and leadership. So yes, the classroom is a great space, but I think all faculty and staff, as well as administration, can benefit from knowing both sides of, of that space. So faculty learning more about budget, finance, the hiring process, how um, money is allocated to state institutions is very informative, but I think also administration and staff can also learn from you know what goes on in that classroom and how um, what an invigorating space and challenging space that is for faculty to ensure that students are progressing through their program. I would say my challenge to faculty would be don't be afraid to step out and connect with a department that would seem at least initially unfamiliar to you. It's very easy to stay connected and work with the colleagues within our department because that seems like a natural fit. Um, there's a task force, the Academic Affairs and Student Development Task Force that I'm a part of that is really geared towards bringing those two worlds together. So what are two offices on campus that may not necessarily work together, but this is a great opportunity to collaborate. So it's actually a proposal that you can go onto the UTC website and submit a proposal that you could get um, funding to help you develop that core collaboration. So that would be my advice is, don't be afraid to see, I'm in the Department of Health and Human Performance. I need to find out what's going on in engineering or business or accounting or a field that may not necessarily seem to align with my department, but figuring out what are some really unique, innovative ways that we can all collaborate together. That gives UTC that face that's really moving forward for the next generation of students. First nugget is to smile. When you smile, people genuinely want to work with you and you need to be enthusiastic about what you do. So if you smile and you find, it, find what it is that you're passionate about, I think that will excel and come out in your personality and people genuinely want to work with you. So that's number one is smile. Two is don't be afraid to take calculated risks. So that's whether that's working with another colleague out in another department, finding a collaboration off campus that may seem like an unlikely pair. So again, not being able not being afraid to make calculated risks that will really support your career, your students, and working with your colleagues. Um, and lastly, give back. What we do as faculty or administration is about service. So we have to find ways to give back to our students and, our, to, and to our community. I really want to have an impact on students, and I've been teaching in higher education for 17 years, so I feel like I have a really strong grasp of the classroom. That's a space where I feel alive, where I feel invigorated, but I also know in order to um, impact and affect change, I have to be visible on a much more global level. And so in order for me to do that, I have to step outside of my comfort zone, which is the classroom, and put myself strategically in places that allow me to be a leader. And so UTC has been very good to me. This opportunity is phenomenal in terms of being an intern in the Office of the Provost, so I'm looking forward to seeing what opportunities um, are available for me to take a next step and um, see how I can lead the students here at UTC. Go Mox, Power C.